and Jules. Good to see you here in Singapore. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Is it your first time in Singapore? Is it my third time actually? I came uh, 2011 with Ferrari because I was a driver for them and then 2012 with uh, Force India. So you already had races in Singapore? I didn't race. I just came as a reserve driver just to be here oh. and uh, in case something happened to the two, two official drivers. Oh, good. So this will be your first race and it's also unique because it's a night race. Have you ever participated in night races before? Um, I did only one race in the night, which was in, uh, in Abu Dhabi, in mm. GP2, 2011, I think, and um, it was a really good experience. I did good results, so I'm, uh, I can't wait to be in, uh, in this track and see how it is. Good, but in terms of preparation, uh, is it in any way different to a regular race? It is different, yes, for sure. Uh, first of all, because uh, it's a night night race, and then the heat is really really high here, so it's quite difficult physically. Um, that's why we are preparing a lot before that, and the track also, also is really difficult because you have many corners. So we are, we did a good preparation on, on the simulator before we came here. Uh, your cooperation with Marusa Formula One team and InstaForex started in Malaysia, where you were incredible, showing one of your best results. Uh, what was this magic combination in Kuala Lumpur that worked out so well for you? Well, obviously, um, <coughs> first race was in Australia, but we didn't we were really prepared because I had a really late call with, uh, with the team, uh, which was three weeks before the, the first race. And that's why I think in Malaysia we came a bit more prepared, even if it was the, the second race and uh, the car worked really well. We had a bit of uh, luck as well and uh, I think we did a really good race, so we need to keep pushing and try to to do a, a good result again, why not here? And now you're one of the rising stars in Formula One. Uh, do you have a goal for this season? And what would you have to achieve to feel completely satisfied? Well, I would like to try to finish every races. Uh, I didn't do, I mean, I had a retirement in, in Monaco and Nürburgring, so I, I would not be able to finish all the races of the season, but I will try to finish as more as possible because the experience for a young driver is really important. And um, if we can score a point, I will, uh, I will be really, really happy to do that for the team. And taking part in these races is a huge responsibility with a lot of uh, tension accompanying it. So maybe for all our traders, it's very interesting. How do you cope with stress when the stakes are so high? Well, you just uh, try to relax when you can and um, try to don't think about the pressure. This is the key, I think, and, and try to do your job as best as you can, that's it. And when you're driving down the track at this enormous speed, are you thinking about anything or your mind and body just working on the level of reflexes? No, you just think about driving, you know. Uh, for sure, when you're on the track, you know it's risky sometimes, but I mean, you're here for that uh, and uh, that's what we love, so... That's the adrenaline. Yes. And what about your plans for the next season? Are you staying with Marussia? I, I think so, for sure. I'm happy with the team. Uh, the team gave me the opportunity to be in Formula 1, so I, I really want to thank them for that. And uh, I like the team. It's really great, showing a great job. Um, next year we'll have a good opportunity with new engine and new, new regulations. So for sure it will be a, a, good, uh, a good move to stay here. Okay, good. And uh, Jules, our interview will be watched by approximately half a million of InstaForex traders. And for all of them, they also want to reach success, but in the Forex market, uh, what would be your success formula and could you give us some tips, please? Well, it's difficult to give any tips, you know, but I can say that uh, if you want something, you just have to really think about it all the time and try to do your best to, to, to have it, you know, and, uh, and never give up. So when you joined Marusa Formula One team, you showed one of your best results and this weekend our brand will be once again on the race car. So we hope that will be a lucky charm for you. So we wish you all the best. Thank you very much. I hope so.